Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more La Milana 2. In the last episode, uh, even though we have the Jed Pillar, we couldn't really find much of anything to do with it. What's this? It's uh, nothing our scanner recognizes. Alright. Fine. This is where we got the rapier. And the light leaks from between the mirror sheen pillars. We still don't have the map of this place either. Oh! Uh, how'd that work? Okay, by holding the down arrow as you land in the snow, alright. Oops. Um. Whoa. What? Okay. Is this a race against the against the thing? Uh, perhaps so. Oh no, I'm trapped. But uh, I I I unlock the thing and we teleport out safely. That's something, right? Also, I'm dangerously low on health here. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> uh, dang it, I got spiked. Oh. Time to uh, time to go heal up before we uh, embarrass ourselves further. Seven hundred thirty-five coins. That's quite impressive. I may, in fact, be able to afford the harp soon. Something. Oops. Keeps happening. What's this? That which is correct goes unscathed. That which is mistaken receives justice by sword. Okay. Doesn't tell me much, but okay. Oh, all right. This is already uh, this is already unlocked. What's in it? The Ankh Jewel. Cool. Let's see. Can't get through here. Oops. What is all this? Oh, I can uh, open up an origin seal up there. That's cool. What's it do? Life begotten of the cold soil. The birth sigil lies in depths of deep, deep snow. Okay. I see... Wait, what just happened? Alright, do I have to fall down from above? Is that the secret? Ow. Frogarang is, uh, rather quite annoying. Also, I gotta waste a zillion... No, I don't. What am I doing? But yeah, why does this shrine make you waste so many weights? It's kinda weird. Alright, let's, uh... Yeah, we can fall down from farther. Boom! 
That's what I wanted to do. What does this do for me, though? The dissonance of the second children lies squarely on the unforgivable sinner Sackett's shoulders. His unforgivable sin was to slay one of his own, bringing about the destruction of his race. Really? Do we need to go to the mausoleum and get some dissonance? Yeah. Oh, hi. Um, how do I get up there? Ah. Ah. And as a matter of fact, I do have enough weights. Of course, after this, I'm going to need to get some more. <laughs> oh, well. There it is! The birth sigil! Finally! I can go around and do some stuff. This enemy is so annoying. In fact, is the story here. Right, I need to go buy some stuff. <clears throat> Alright, that's fine. We got plenty of coins. Uh, like, 20 weights should probably be good. Alright, is there anything to do up here uh, before I go back into the rooms? Don't seem that way. Yeah. Alright. Back down we go. First stop, La Mulana. To go find some dissonance. Socket is down here. to go find the real socket <laughs> or maybe it's uh, down that other corridor that uh, seemed kind of useless to us might as well right Okay, I guess I was wrong. Alright, where do we want to go? <clears throat> well, let's start at the Divine Fortress, since uh, I do remember seeing some birth seals there. It's like a whole new world of stuff opened up to us. Because I solved the puzzle of the snow pile. Oops. Yeah, right here. It's a secret shop or something. Something along those lines.
alert. And there's something fishy in the room. Poison gas is detected in the vicinity. Alarm, an alarm will sound. Okay. Cool. Three thrones in a row on that in that diagram, and there was text behind one of them. I wonder if that means anything. Well, either way, we haven't gone through the uh, entirety of the uh, fortress yet. something to the left of here, actually. Well, I guess it's a little late to check now. Valkyrie! I'm gonna miss my cycle because of you. Look at that. Go back to Marvel Land. Mistaken. Ow. Ow. Whoops! <laughs> that was a uh, that was quite a fall there, Lumisa. All right, off to. Actually, no. One more screen I want to check, but actually it would be faster to teleport. Doink. Not really sure how much good the uh, the alert is gonna do here, but whatever. Onward. Oh wait, this is the room I wanted to check, but it doesn't have a birth seal anywhere. All right, moving on. Valhalla. Nothing here. Yeah. Anything? Uh, that's a life seal, not a birth seal. Up we go. Here, if I drop down, anything? Only spikes. All right, Immortal Battlefield. I know for sure there are birth seagulls around here that can undo. Yeah. That's a life seal. Yeah. 
the, uh, the chest opened up. Ooh, sacred orb. I will gladly take that. It. There was a birth seal in Anufun too, wasn't there? I don't want to say there was. There's a birth seal here. Which we can get by going down and around and then up. Is there anything to get by going this way? Well, maybe, but I want to go up first. Because uh, this could be very important for us. Aha! It's a stoop. It's a ladder. And, uh, is that a cat skeleton? Not happening, buddy. I gotta leave him. Aha! I can get up here. That didn't do very much. Nine! Nine souls. At least I think that's what I'm reading there. Alright, I can probably uh, dash through. Yeah. What's this? Those who possess Mjolnir can harden storms. Lightning a strike symbol, there's to wield. But be wary, for the body can absorb only so much. Alright, good to know. You know. I bet Mjolnir is the prize we get for killing Jormagand. So, uh... Hmm. Maybe that's not the first thing I want to be doing here. For three souls. How do I get over there? It's a mystery. Well, I guess I have to come from the other side, is, uh, is what is going on here. a life seal. Says, oh right, that's just the trap door. Alright, well let's uh let's ride on over to the other side of this place and see if there's anything here we can accomplish. And then we'll go to Anufun. Wasn't there also also one in the uh, in the Star Lord's mausoleum? I want to say so. This is ice fire, right? Yeah. Not quite the place I wanted to be, but I mean, we can always look around. Yeah, there's like nothing of value here, is there? 
Oops. Danger! Magma! Yes, thank you. <laughs> that's, just, that's just kind of funny, really. Yeah, it's totally nothing. Alright, off to Onfoon, Land of the Fairies. Fish thing is so weird. I'm looking for the Shrine Maiden's room, I'm pretty sure. It's uh, currently not here. Ow. Yes! Right over there. Invisibat! Coming to an Invisibat near you. I can't get through. Here's a one-way door in the way. That's great. How do I get over there? I guess I come down from below? I guess so. Oh, I can get this now. What is this? <coughs> it's a crystal skull! New message. Oops. The Fairy Queen has come to Eglana. I came along as a escort and it was my first time entering Eglana. Goodness, that was scary. You're quite the incredible adventurer, huh? But at least I was able to bring the Fairy Queen safely back to the Fairy King and Anvathun. I'm going home. Alright, what does this skull have to say to us? Words of Asuraline. Asuraline. Okay. That's an interesting message. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I just wasted a weight again. Yes, okay. We're good. What is this? And why is it important? Oh! Hello, new mantra! Whoops. The author spoke of the vast expanse of greens of what is known as Earth. Those who seek must speak the name of Ioro. All right. Okay, first of all, let's go say hi to the Fairy Queen. Now that she's here in Eglana. And then we return to the roots. Claim the treasure of the Golden Boulder. I'm glad you're well. My brother's body is reaching the end of its life, so I've come here. From now on, I will assist you in my brother's stead. Please come see me if you need anything. The fairies found in the Lamalana ruins were created using the Tree of Life, based on the fairy race of the six children. There are few fairies remaining in Neglana, and I heard that they have been captured by other races. I just pray they are safe. Alright. Back to the roots we go! And, uh, not... Well, yeah, I guess we can go down. So I don't land on spikes, blah.
Eoro. Huh? What does this do for us? Hide! That did nothing for me. Um, what am I missing here? Ow. do for me. But, like, seriously, what did I just accomplish? Stores the power of the stars. Okay, I solved the puzzle, still don't know how to destroy that rock without a... <coughs> without getting killed. Unless that was the wrong mantra. can't do anything without the life sigil anyway. Dang it. Well, alright. That was, uh, kind of, kind of sort of fruitless. Alright, we're gonna leave that be until, uh, until we have something a little different. Danger, health drain. Yes, I know. to you though, the age of silver. And I still don't know what any of these how any of these are important. It rests at the fire altar of the land where warriors get. We've been there. We've been there and I didn't see a mantra. Well, I can drop down, that's something. What's in here? Uh, the Amarna of the Fifth Children. Yeah, we can unlock this now. It's just the map. Oh, dang it. The Heaven and Earth room. Really? What room is this? Dark Star Lord's Hall. Fire rain upon the Earth. But that doesn't actually mean very much to me right now. Well, what happens if I use the wrong mantras? Evidently nothing.
Dark Star Lord could harness storms. Yeah. Oops. Uh oh. Celestial Body Room. It's not like I even know what I'm doing. Also, that's a that's a lot of enemies just in the way. What is over there? I want to get over there. We've been at this for half an hour, and we got a heck of a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm going to have to go through this again and uh, figure out what all we got. <laughs> so yeah, going to save, and we're going to keep exploring in the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye for now.